Now, how old was you when you moved to Parkersburg? Well, when, when I, I come to Parkersburg in 1913, I was 21. Yeah. And I've come to go to the Mountain State Business College. So what did you do? You, you just come down here just to go to school? Was that what it That's was? That's what I come for. That's what I come for. So you finished your uh, your your home school when you was about 14? Oh, or about 15. 15. But you see, then Ben and I went to what we called a summer school or summer normal up above uh, Glenville. A true lady is just a country school. And there's an old teacher there, uh, F. B. Wilfong. Oh, he was a he was a jewel. He was one of the nicest fellows you ever saw. He was an old like man, but he taught school all his life, and was a good one. And he had this summer school, and I suppose there's probably thirty or forty of us, men and women, come there for two months training for teachers. Now that was in nineteen and. Uh, nine. You see, I was 17 years old. Nine and eight, 17, you see. I was eight years old up to the century, and then 1909, I was 17 in January, and the requirement was for teachers, they must be eight time, uh, 17 years old. So Ben and I goes up there to uh, the summer school, two months. Now, it didn't cost us very much, but uh, we had a baseball team and uh, had a good time. And uh, I went to San Fort for the uniform examination, we called it. And uh, sure enough, when I got my grade back, I failed. Oh, my. Failed on theory and art, just one subject. All my other subjects were second grade. I made good grades on almost theory and art. So I had to, before I could teach, I had to pass theory and art. So I went back to Glenville in the next examination and passed it and got my second grade teacher certificate. And uh, then I, of course, 17 years old, I was qualified to be a teacher. That is, in that respect, I don't think I was very much qualified otherwise. What did you think? Uh, I'd finished uh, Ray's arithmetic. Uh, uh, that was regular arithmetic and uh, uh, square root, cube root, longitude and time, uh, uh, interest and uh, fractions and all that stuff. I was I do say it myself, I must have been pretty good in arithmetic. But anyway, I made good grades, second grade, and got a school over on Laurel and, uh, for $35 a month. And I taught that, that year, and then I taught the next year on Laurel. And then the third year, of course, the certificate lasted for three years. Then the third year, I went over on Little Bear Run <laughs> and taught school over there for six months. And that was the end of my teaching career, as in the spring of 1912 is when I finished. And then I was home, of course, for the rest of 1912 and come down here in July 1913 to go to school. Come down here on a boat, how did you how did you come? How did you travel to Parkersburg when you came? On a boat?